In this discussion, you can see how to create custom add-ons directory for custom modules and execute Odoo service with existing Odoo add-ons plus custom add-ons. In case you missed previous video related how to create quick custom module using scaffold command, please check link is given in description. If you don't subscribe yet, please subscribe to get uh, latest notification. So now, uh, as you know, like uh, we already created two custom modules inside uh, add-ons directory. One is a school and another is a school underscore student like which is not a good practice like uh, we are adding uh, custom add-ons inside uh, Odoo's default add-ons path it is also possible to create one more add-ons directory name is a custom add-ons you can see here this is our custom underscore add-ons path and uh, we are moving these two add-ons inside our new add-ons directory here so you can see here right now it's not visible here like it's already moved inside custom underscore add-ons directory and here you can see in terminal Odoo will get all the latest modules from this directory so whenever we are going to browser and refresh the page here it will rise one error because the Odoo will not find this school.profile module and due to that Odoo rise this error exception so now we are going to terminal and stop this Odoo service here we have to use one more command is add-ons desk path using this command we are just adding multiple add-ons path here first of all we have to use our add-ons directory which is Odoo's default directory and then after we have to use the custom directory path and press the enter key to it will active the Odoo service now you can see here the Odoo will now check modules from here in custom underscore add-ons path again we are going to browser and refresh the page it will execute perfectly because this module recognized by Odoo using this custom underscore add-ons path so if you have a multiple add-ons paths you can just give anywhere and make sure you will give a proper add-ons path using this dash dash add-ons dash path or you can also use add-ons dash path in configuration file and over there you can just add multiple add-ons path using comma that's it for now in case you have any doubt please comment below and see you in next video